Hey guys, it's the Chase at Rocky Mountain Nate's VMC and welcome to our dual sport and adventure riding pant buyer's guide. All right guys, so we know that most of you when you get into dual sport adventure riding like myself, you're typically gonna start out with cheaper gear that you probably already have sitting in the closet, but I promise you it won't take long before you realize that having good gear is an investment worth making. It's gonna do a couple of things for you. One, it's gonna give you protection if you do have a crash. It's also gonna be very adaptable to changing climate. It's gonna keep you warm and dry on those cool and rainy days. It's also gonna breathe and keep you cool on those warm and hot summer days as well. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna make your search easier. We have narrowed it down to five of our favorite pants here at Rocky Mountain that we know and love. And we're gonna walk through each one and we're gonna talk about each one in detail so you know exactly what you're getting. We're gonna start the low end of price, that bang for your buck, and we're gonna work our way up into some of your more technical pants that are available. But do keep in mind that most people, when they get pants, they wanna pair it with the jacket that matches those. And we have a gear guide where we talk about all the jackets that go along with each of the pants that we're gonna talk about today. Now it's time to sit back, relax, and let's get right to it. All right, so first up on the list, this is the Battleborn pant from ARC. Now ARC, they do an incredible job of making feature-rich pants and jackets at a very good price point. Now I've got Chance in here today. Chance is six feet tall, he's 220 pounds, he has a 36 inch waist, and he is rocking a 36 in this pant. Now, quick note about sizing. When we measure our waist for these pants, it's a true waist measurement, so it's gonna be around the belly button. So make sure you look at the sizing chart on the website. Don't just assume you're gonna wear your actual pant size you use for jeans when you're buying these adventure pants. Now moving on. Now, Battleborn pant is gonna be, the shell material is gonna be a 600 denier, it's highly abrasion resistant, and you are gonna get that waterproof Z liner on the inside. You also do have a zip-in removable thermal liner as well, so a lot of functionality with these pants. If we start up here at the top, you're gonna to have a ratchet closure system. That's gonna be able to make sure he can cinch these pants down extremely well. We open it up, big YKK zipper in the front, very beefy, very durable zippers. You also do have adjustment straps up here around the waist, so Chance is really gonna be able to cinch these pants down extremely well. So if we move our way down, you're getting three external pockets on these pants. You're getting two up here at the top, and you're gonna have one over here on the left side of the leg, and they are gonna be waterproof zippers, so that's a great feature from ARC. Working our way down, big reflective piping here on both legs, that's gonna make you light up extremely well if a car's lights hit you and you're riding at nighttime. And what I love about this is the ventilation, if we look, two giant ventilation zips along the front of these pants. So if Chance is riding in these pants, if he's in that upright sitting position, if he unzips these, that is gonna give a ton of airflow and that's gonna allow these pants to breathe extremely well. Now continuing our way down the pant here at the knee, again, more reflective piping at the top of the knee. You are gonna get CE rated armor in the knees. Again, bang for your buck, there is a ton of protection built into these pants. And you are gonna get that ballistic poly fabric over the knee to give that extra abrasion resistance and that 600 denier material continuing throughout the entire bottom of the pant. So Chance, turn around for me. So back of the pant here, good stretch panel along the waist. Again, that's gonna make these comfortable, give sh good stretch there. That's 600 denier throughout the entire back of the pant. As we work our way down to the back here, down at the bottom, you are gonna have three snaps of adjustability, and these are gonna open up extremely wide. They leave plenty of room on the inside of these pants. So if you do wanna wear pants underneath these, you can, but really with that thermal liner in there, you just need to rock some base layers, some simple base layers, and you will stay plenty warm on those colder days. You take that thermal liner out, these pants are gonna breathe well, so they're gonna transition very well into those warmer, hotter climates. So Chance, face the front for me. So this is the Battleborn pant from ARC. Like I said before, it blows my mind that you can have a pant this feature rich with that kind of protection, sub $200. So make sure you go check these pants out. All right, so next up on the list, we've got the Kathmandu pant from First Gear. Now First Gear, they've been around a long time. Now Kathmandu has really been a staple in their lineup for a lot of years. So what you're getting, you're getting a four season pant. It's gonna be waterproof with that high protects liner. You are gonna get a thermal zip in liner underneath that as well. That's gonna be a two third length. One thing I do wanna point out, this pant is an over pant. It is meant to be wear, worn over the clothes that you already have on. So looking at it, I've got Chance here. Chance is six feet tall, he's got a 36 inch waist. He's wearing a size 36 in this pant. 
Construction wise, you're gonna get 300 denier throughout the entire pant, but in those high abrasion zones, you're gonna get a 420 denier ripstop material. And that ripstop, the way it's stitched on there, if it does rip, the stitching prevents it from ripping even further. So that's a great touch from first gear. So if we start at the top and work our way down, here at the top, you are gonna have a snap and loop closure. You are gonna get a big beefy YKK zipper up there in the front, and you are gonna have adjustment straps up here at the top. So Chance is really gonna be able to cinch those down. Nice touch from first gear. You are gonna have bibs and suspenders with this, and I'll show you the backside here in just a minute. Now when we talk about protection, you're gonna get, this is an upgrade with this pant. You're gonna get D3 on molecular armor. You're gonna get that, that CE rated. You're gonna get it in the hips, and you're also gonna get it in the knees. And if you look, it starts here at the top of the knee, and it goes about halfway down Chance's shin. So you're gonna get a lot of impact protection with these pants. Now up here at the top, these two pockets right here. Now remember before I said these are an over pant. So you're gonna have a water guard YKK zipper, and these pants are meant to reach through and get to the pockets in the clothes that you are already wearing. So keep that in mind. Now working our way down, a lot of ventilation with these pants. You're gonna get huge 10 and a half inch zips right here on each leg. So you want to unzip that, it's gonna fold in on itself, and that vent's gonna allow a lot of air to come through these pants. And again, you're getting that on both sides, and you are gonna get a cargo pocket right here on the right leg as well. So here in the groin area, you're getting big waterproof stretch panels. That's a great touch. It really makes these pants comfortable when you're sitting on the motorcycle. If we work our way down, again, here in the knees, that's that 420 height, that 420 ripstop material that starts here in the knee, goes all the way down the pant. If I have a chance, turn his leg out for me. So here on the inside of the knee, again, another nice touch from them. You got this suede panel right here. So when you're rocking your new 1200 GS or your 690, you're not gonna scratch your baby up having that suede panel there. And again, 420 denier all the way down to the, to the bottom of the leg. Now Chance, can I be turning around for me? So here in the back, again, there's gonna be your bib. It is gonna be mesh back, so it's gonna ventilate, it's gonna breathe well, and that is gonna have a zipper, so if Chance wants to, he can unzip that and remove it. Right here, this is gonna be your jacket to pant zipper. Again, if you want zero water, the chance of any water getting into the pant, you would just connect the jacket to the pant right here. So if we work our way down, Big stretch panel along the yoke here. Again, lots of flexibility. Big stretch panels on the inner groin here, and we've already talked about that 420 rip stop, and even more flex panels here on the back of the knee as well. Now, Chance, quarter turn for me. All right, so this is gonna be for you guys out there. If you like to rock moto boots, this is gonna be a pant that's gonna be perfect for you. So what First Gear has done is down here at the bottom, they have left this and they've, they've made the panel here extremely large. So if you see here, this is gonna zip all the way up to the back of his knee. So it's gonna make this open extremely large. So you'll be able to fit these pants over your moto boots if that's what you like to wear. So a ton of adjustability there. And you are gonna have this gator on the inside. Again, that's gonna keep water from creeping up the boot and getting inside. So huge opening there. So if you guys, if you like to rock a moto boot or like to have a lot of space at the bottom of your pant, this is gonna be the choice you're gonna wanna look at. So Chance, face the front for me. So here it is, this is the Catman Dew Pant from First Gear. Again, a lot of functionality. You're getting an upgrade in the armor to that molecular armor, and you're getting a lot of versatility with this pant. So make sure you go check this one out. All right guys, so next up on the list, we've got the Sand 2 Pant from Revit. Now Revit, they're a European company, and they make very technical gear. I've got Vinny here. Vinny is six feet tall, he's 160 pounds, he has a 32 inch waist. He's wearing a size medium in these pants. Now keep in mind, these pants do come in short and tall sizes as well. So when we look at the pant from a construction standpoint, you're getting a mixture of five and 600 denier. You're also gonna get 1200 denier Lorica in those high abrasion areas. And it's also a three layer pant. You have the outer shell. On the inside, you're gonna have your Hydrotex waterproof lining that's gonna be zippable and removable. And inside there, you're gonna have your thermal liner, which is also removable. So you're getting a lot of versatility with this pant. So starting up here at the top, you are gonna have hook and snap closure, big YKK zipper, you're gonna have plenty of room to get in and out of these, and you are gonna have a lot of adjustment, so if you're between sizes, you're gonna have these big adjustment straps around the waist, making sure you're gonna be able to cinch these down extremely well. So working our way down, you're gonna have dual pockets on each hip. Now keep in mind these are not waterproof pockets, but you are gonna get storm flaps to help that water bead off. If we work our way down a little bit farther, Vinny quarter turn for me. You're gonna have these cargo pockets on each hip, big reflective piping up here at the top, big storm flap, remember, they're not waterproof pockets, and on each pocket here, you are gonna have big zip vents that come down, that's gonna give you that ventilation on those warmer days. Now, Vinny, turn back for me. 
So down here at the knee area, this is very important, okay? This is where you're getting that CE rated pro-life armor from Revit. It comes from here, it starts at the top of the knee and actually comes about midway down his shin. So they're giving you a lot of protection on the leg area and you are gonna have stretch panels above the knee, just making sure you're gonna have flexibility with these pants. So Vinny, turn your leg out towards me a little bit. Here on the inside, this is where you get that 1200 denier Lorica. That's gonna be a very high abrasion resistant material. It's also a softer waxy material, so it's not gonna scratch up your motorcycle or your tank where you have that contact with your motorcycle. Turn it back out for me. Working our way down again, that 500 and 600 denier working all the way down the pant here. And if I have Vinny face away, so here on the outside of the pant, down here at the bottom, big reflective piping. Again, lots of adjustment, huge Velcro strap here. And if you see here, big YKK zipper with a nice zipper garage, plenty of opening. You are gonna have a gator on the inside to help water not keep from running up the pant. And the nice thing is this opens up so big, if you do like to wear a moto boot, this is gonna open up wide enough to fit over those boots. Now Vinny, face the back for me. So if we look at the back, you're gonna have two different zipper connections for your jacket. That's a nice touch from Revit. You're gonna have a full 360 degree zipper up here, and that's gonna be a beefy Vizlon YKK zipper, really the beefiest zipper you're gonna get on any pant. You're also gonna have a seven inch zipper here as well, so it's just your preference which one of those you wanna use. And you are gonna have big stretch panels along the seat area here to make sure when you're sitting on that motorcycle, plenty of flexibility with these pants. Reinforced denier on the seat area, and if you zoom in closely here, you can actually see they put grit panels underneath the seat area. That's a nice touch. They just wanna make sure you're gonna have a good grip on that seat, even in those wet conditions. So Vinny, face back around for me. So this is the Sand 2 from Revit. You're coming in at just over that $300 mark. Again, a very technical pant. We love the design of it, so make sure you go check these out. All right, so next up on the list, we've got the Durban pant from Alpine Stars. Now, Alpine Stars is a European company and they make rock solid gear. I've got Vinny here again, 160 pounds, 32 inch waist. He is wearing a size small in this pant. I do wanna point out to you guys, so these pants are meant to use the armor that comes included. These pants are a bit slimmer fitting than some of your other pants. So if you do like to wear some sort of knee brace or a knee pad underneath that, I am gonna warn you, you're probably gonna have a hard time getting these pants over that. So just keep that in mind when you're looking at these pants. Looking at it, we are now stepping into Gore-Tex. Guaranteed to keep you dry and guaranteed for life when it comes to anything waterproof, nothing's gonna beat Gore-Tex. The outside construction of this pant, it's gonna be a 500 denier shell. It's very lightweight. This is the lightest pant that we have in the lineup. And that waterproof lining is gonna have microface lining it's gonna be on the inside. It's a zippable, removable liner. So the shell itself is not gonna be waterproof, but it does have a Teflon coating, so it's gonna be very water repellent. But that waterproof membrane is gonna be on the inside. Just keep that in mind. So looking at the pant, starting up here at the top, you do have suspenders that do come with these pants. They are removable, and we'll look at the bib and the backside here in just a minute. But up at the top, you are gonna have hook and snap closure, big beefy zipper, plenty of room there to get into these pants and you are gonna have adjustment straps up here at the hip. You're gonna be really be able to cinch these pants down. I do wanna point out though, one nice touch that Alpine Stars has done, Vinny, if you do a quarter turn for me. You are up here at the top, you are gonna have this waterproof pocket. Now it is 100% waterproof, that is gonna be up here at the hip. You're gonna have that on both sides. Vinny, face back to the front. So if we work our way down here in the groin area, you're gonna have a high abrasion resistant denier material, but it's gonna be a stretch panel. It's gonna allow these pants to really move and work well with your body. You are gonna have big cargo style pockets on each hip. Again, those are not waterproof, but you do have big storm flaps, so that's gonna help that water beat off well. Each leg up here on the thigh, you are gonna have these zip panels. That's gonna allow for ventilation. It's gonna allow the airflow to come through the pant. Now, this is one of my favorite features about this pant. Vinny, if you turn your leg out for me. So here on the inside, what they've done is you have a full grain leather panel that runs from the inside of the knee and that goes all the way down to the ankle. So a lot of abrasion, a lot of heat resistance. And it's also gonna make sure you don't scratch up your nice pretty motorcycle while you're out riding. Turn it back for me, Vinny. So underneath the knee here, you are gonna have that Nucleon CE rated armor that Alpine Stars has included in here. It's not a molecular armor but it's flexible, and no matter what the temperature is, it's gonna stay the same, so it's gonna be comfortable all day long. Nice reflective piping on the knees here, and if I lift this up, you are gonna have big accordion stretch panels here above the knee, 
to make sure you get that good flexibility with these pants. Over the top of the knee, now you're getting super fabric. Okay, it's, it's laser ceramic material over the top of the knee. It is the highest degree of abrasion resistance you're gonna find with any material that is available. If we work our way down, Vinny, quarter turn for me. So working our way down the pant, you are gonna have these big Velcro flaps here, and you are gonna have a big zipper that comes midway up the calf to make sure you have plenty of room to get these pants on. So really, Alpine starts has thought about everything when it comes to protection and safety. So Vinny, face the back. So up here at the top, so here's your bib. This is gonna be a part of your suspender. This is gonna zip on, so you can take that off if you want to. That's gonna be the rider preference. And right here, big 360 degree zipper that goes all the way around. That's gonna allow you to connect these pants to your jacket. Again, that's rider preference if you want to do that. Here in the seat area, I like that they have this big yoke. It gives you plenty of flexibility. Again, very high abrasion resistant material in the seat. So you're gonna get a ton of life out of these pants. So Vinny, face back to the front for me. So this is the Durbin pant from Alpine Stars. Again, we're stepping up into that Gore-Tex range, the highest degree of waterproofness that you're gonna get. A lot of functionality built in these pants. Just keep in mind, the fit on these, it is a little bit slimmer than some of your other pants out there. But however, they do fit well and we love the design of them, so make sure you check these out. All right, so last up on the list, I have got the Badland pant from Climb. Now I've got Josh here. Josh is six foot two, he's 190 pounds. He has a 33 inch waist, and he is rocking a size medium in this pant. For all you tall guys, keep in mind they do have short and tall sizes in this pant. Now, if you're a guy, if you're looking for the most durable, bomb-proof pant that you can truly wear in any condition, this is gonna be the pant for you. When we look at it, you're getting Gore-Tex's three-layer pro laminate technology. So this is a shell only, keep that in mind. You gotta have your own base layers when you're rocking these pants. But that Gore-Tex shell, it's gonna be on the inside of the pant and it's gonna be laminated to the back. It truly is the highest degree of waterproofness you're gonna get from Gore-Tex. The outer construction of this pant, you're getting three main materials. You're getting 840 D Cordura, you're getting Armor Core, and you're also gonna get super fabric as well. So like I said, the highest degree of abrasion resistance of any pant available. If we start at the top here, if you look, you're gonna get dual snap closure, big YKK zipper going down the front, plenty of adjustability up here at the hips. So Josh is really gonna be able to cinch these pants down. And I like about these pants, They've made sure you have plenty of room to get those base layers underneath. So this is a pant that's really gonna suit those bigger guys out there. If we work our way down, Josh Quarter, turn to the side for me. They've made sure the pants are gonna ventilate extremely well. You have these giant vent zips here on each hip. You're gonna get those YKK Vizlon waterproof zippers, really the beefiest zipper available today. Here on each hip as well, you are gonna have waterproof pockets on each side. Just like we said, a lot of built-in protection and safety with these pants. And this is the first pant we're seeing where you're gonna get CE rated hip protection that comes with these pants. You're gonna get that D3O T5 Evo XT. That's a molecular armor, which means it's gonna stay flexible, but it's gonna disperse impact energy extremely well. You're getting that in the hip and in the knee. So Josh, turn back front for me. All right, so as we work our way down now into the knee area, again, you're getting that CE level D3O molecular armor in the knee, and you're gonna get that underneath that super fabric, which again, is the highest degree of abrasion resistance you're gonna find on any pant available. Josh, if you turn your knee out for me. So here on the inside, nice stretch panels along the groin area, and right here, a big full grain leather panel. So if you're rocking that new 1200 GS, that is not gonna scratch up your new baby. Going your way down again, you're getting that 840 D Cordura along the inside there. So again, extremely good durability with these pants. They are gonna last forever. So Josh, turn and face the back for me. All right, so when we look at the back of the pants starting up here at the top, this is gonna be your big zipper. That's gonna be your jacket to pant connection there. That's gonna be optional for you guys. Now, one thing I love, this is the only pant, again, on that protection level, you're gonna get a pour on XRD tailbone pad that is inside these pants. So more impact protection there as well. Nice big stretch panel here along the yoke, plenty of flexibility. Love the reflective piping. Again, lots of visibility at nighttime. And right here in the entire seat area, this is gonna be Armor Core. It's a step up from that 840D. It is gonna be even better when it comes to abrasion and durability. Working our way down here on the back of the leg, you are gonna have two vent zips. They're gonna be those YKK Vizlon zippers. They're gonna be waterproof. 
and you are gonna have these nice big zipper garages that's gonna make sure no water can get there. Now this is one of my favorite designs that Climb has done with this pant. If you look at the back of the knee here, Josh actually has two adjustment straps. So what he's gonna do is gonna put that, that molecular armor in place and then what he's gonna do is gonna take these straps and he's gonna cinch them down. So it's gonna do a couple of things. It's gonna keep that armor in place no matter what position he's riding in. It's also gonna take that excess material and cinch it down so nothing is flapping around in the wind. That is a great design from Climb. Now, if we continue all the way down the leg here, again, more reflective piping along the entire calf. Big zipper that's gonna open up. You are gonna have a gator inside there as well to keep water from running up the boot. Plenty of adjustability to get these over. And down here at the bottom, you are gonna have three snaps of adjustment. So you're gonna really be able to get these cinched down to where you want them. So Josh, face the front for me. So again, this is the Badland pant from Climb. Now when it comes to a pant that is durable, you can wear year round in any weather condition that is gonna stand the test of time, look no further, this is gonna be the most durable pant available. So make sure you go to our website and check these out. Here's a recap of the buyer's guide to give you guys a side-by-side -side comparison of some of the common features as well as the standout features that really make these products unique. All right guys, so thanks for checking out our dual sport and adventure riding pant buyer's guide. Now your next step is go to our website at RockyMountainATVMC.com where you can shop the full collection of pants and read rider reviews. And don't forget, we have an adventure jacket buyer's guide as well where we talk about all the jackets in detail that match the pants that you've seen today. And if you're worried about fit, we have our fit guarantee. So if you get a size that you're not happy with, just send it back to us and we will make sure that you get the right size on that first exchange free of charge. Now the last thing I need you to do before I let you go is click and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'd love to hear your thoughts and comments on this gear and always check out the latest gear guides and product spotlights that we're constantly rolling out. I'm Chase at Rocky Mountain and we'll see you on the trails.